Well, we do have an update now about the volcano that erupted in the Iceland area. New pictures coming into us. You can see that lava flowing there. The volcano area has not been active in 6,000 years, and the Icelandic Meteorological Office said that this eruption is considered small stage. However, they are still warning people that the area is still dangerous, and the eruption site can just change abruptly without much notice, putting people at risk. As I mentioned, it had been dormant in that area for 6,000 years and so it is certainly a sight to see. Now, speaking of volcanoes, let's talk about how they erupt in the first place. So beneath the surface of the earth, there is rock down there. That rock gets heated, it melts and becomes magma, and then it slowly rises up through the magma chambers, and eventually it is able to erupt and flow out as lava. And there are several hazards surrounding volcanoes, just a few of them, sulfur dioxide. That is a gas that the Icelandic Meteorological Office is monitoring. It, it comes when the volcanoes erupt and it can be very irritating to the skin, to the eyes, to the lungs. So you do have to watch out for that. Not to mention, it does not smell very good at all, I am told. And then on top of that, there's volcanic ash. And they haven't seen much of that coming out of this particular volcano, but volcano volcanic ash can be quite hazardous, especially to uh, air travel, getting caught up into the engine. So that's not a good thing there. And also, you certainly don't want to be around breathing that as well. So just a few hazards, and thankfully, uh, these are minimal as of now, according to the Icelandic Meteorological Office. Marcella? All right, Mary, thank you.